you, Tarlan. It is November 22nd. This is Jimmy from The Deadlies once again. I'm here at Napa Music Supply, one of the wonderful music stores that we have in Northern California where they have many, many beautiful guitars like this one right here. A beautiful amp like that one right there behind me. And I'm here to wish a very happy birthday to um, three instrumentalists. Very important. First one is Stephen Van Zandt, born on this day in Boston, Massachusetts. Of course, he is Little Stephen, also known as Miami Steve. He plays guitar in a little band called Bruce Springsteen and the E Street Band. Also was a founding member of Southside Johnny, produced a lot of Southside Johnny's records. He's also worked with Darlene Love, Joey Ramone, many, 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 many more people. He has his own channel on Sirius XM called Little Steven's Underground Garage. I highly suggest you listen to it because it's wonderful. He has a sister-in-law that was very, very important to the um, males of a certain era, me being one of them, and that would be our Adrian Barbeau. He's the, that's his sister-in-law. Hmm. Go figure. Uh, Ron McClure was also born on this day. He's a bass player extraordinaire, way beyond my, uh, my abilities and talents. Uh, he was born on this day in New Haven, Connecticut, um, of course, he was a member of the classic lineup of Blood, Sweat, and Tears. He's also worked with John Schofield, John Abercrombie, also worked with Randy Brecker. It's also the birthday of the champion of blues guitar and a founder of the band Foghat, and that would be Rod Price. <laughs> Finally, it is the birthday of one of the most important albums the Beatles put out, and that is the White Album. Put out this day, uh, their last album that had all the Beatles together, put out this day um, many, many years ago, <laughs> 1970, and included this one song that's very appropriate for this video, and it goes like this. <laughs> Thank you everybody. Continue to subscribe to uh, Vintage Guitar Magazine. It's a wonderful music magazine. You should check it out. Very important to uh, everything that's going on in the music industry right now, especially with instruments the way they are.